what rainwater does to your pool chemistry. Rainwater might seem harmless, but when it falls into your pool, it can seriously mess with your water chemistry. If you don't know what to look for, it can lead to algae, corrosion, and costly maintenance. Let's break down exactly what rain does to your pool and how to fix it. Problem one is it lowers your pH and alkalinity. Rainwater has a naturally low pH, usually around 5 to 5.5, and when it enters your pool, it lowers both the pH and total alkalinity, making the water more acidic. Acidic water can corrode metal parts, damage pool surfaces, and even irritate swimmer skin and eyes. Problem two, it dilutes your pool chemicals. Your pool is carefully balanced with chlorine, alkalinity, and stabilizers. When rainwater enters, it dilutes these chemicals, making your sanitizer less effective. This means bacteria and algae can start growing faster than usual. Problem three is it adds contaminants in organic matter. Rain doesn't just bring water, it also carries dust, pollen, and airborne pollutants. Once these contaminants enter your pool, they become food for algae and bacteria, leading to cloudy water and increased chemical demand. Problem number four is it introduces phosphates and nitrogen. Some rainwater contains phosphates and nitrogen, which acts as a fertilizer for algae. If you're noticing more algae growth after a storm, this could be the reason. Problem number five is it affects the calcium hardness. Rainwater is soft, meaning it lacks minerals like calcium. If too much rainwater enters your pool, it can lower your calcium hardness levels, which can cause plaster and grout to degrade over time. So how do we fix it? Well, you wanna test your water after heavy rain to check the pH, alkalinity, and chlorine levels. Adjust your pH and alkalinity using the chemicals for your pool as needed. And then if you have to, you could shock your pool, which means putting a really high level of chlorine to help kill bacteria and algae before they get out of control. You can skim and vacuum any debris to keep the contaminants out. And then if possible, you can use a pool cover to prevent the rainwater from entering in the first place. Now rainwater seems harmless, but it can throw off your pool's balance quickly. So stay on top of your water chemistry and you'll avoid the costly problems down the road. If you found this video helpful, please give us a like and a subscribe for more pool care tips.